standard fifth subject evs part 1 lesson number 12 food for all green revolution today our nation is self reliant in production of food grains is concern we are exporting the surplus grain to the other countries this tremendous increase in production of food grain is known as green revolution This green revolution took place with combined efforts of scientists people working for the spread of science and farmers the credit for the research that leads to the improvement in seeds of rice and wheat that res- resulted into green revolution goes to Dr M S Swaminathan food security food is our basic need many countries have formulated laws to ensure that every person get sufficient food according to their need These laws are known as food security law. In 2013, our country to enacted a food security law. This enable us to fight this fight ills like malnutrition, starvation, death due to hunger, etc. Agricultural assistance program. Through this program, farmers are given proper information and guidance about the modern agricultural technology, irrigation facilities, improved seeds. use of different fertilizer and pesticides etc as weather changes affects feather it affect factors like growth and its productivity farmers now get weather forecast assistance center farmers now get information about weather for assistance centers this assistance centers also provide the farmers with our necessary agricultural related information apart from this agricultural school have also been started for farmers in this school members of the farmers family are educated about new agricultural techniques agriculture produce marketing community community hold agricultural agriculture produce marketing community hold agricultural exhibition too for farmers the agricultural department agricultural university television newspaper various agricultural periodical work work for the spread of modern methods of agriculture by using new agricultural methods farmers are now able to obtain obtain high crop yield the whole country benefit from this efforts organic farming do you know farming that relies on natural or organic materials is is called organic farming it is a form of traditional farming in this types of farming nutritive substances in the soil are added The organic pesticide is used in this types of farming. It does not have any harmful effect on those who eat those who eat this produce. The food grain obtained organic farming. The food grain obtained from farm from organic farming is nutritive and good to taste. So the farmer are now opting this method of organic farming. Manures obtained from plants animals that is organic manure are used in organic farming. Manures obtained from animals are used in obtain include fish and bone meal animal excreta cow dung decomposition remains of animals where whereas manure obtained from plant include the unusable parts of the crops plant parts or the remains of the plants always remember crop should be water only as much as necessary chemical fertilizer and pesticide being with the poisonous must be handled in care Empty tins of chemical fertilizer and pesticides must be kept away from children, animals, hens, from children, animals, hens, etc. Do not use these tins for any other purpose. Overuse of chemical fertilizer and pesticides must be avoided. Have we learned? There are two main agricultural season: the Kharif and the Rabi season. Using improved method of farming leads to an increase in production. Get info. Farmers can get information about modern agricultural technology through agricultural assistant programs. So we had completed our lesson number twelve, that is food for all. Thank you.